I mean, it's just crazy how it comes down to this, man. And I can't believe you would do something like this to me after everything we've been through. We were together for eight years. We had our ups and downs. I mean, what relationship doesn't? I mean, eight years, married for four, together for eight, two kids. They're beautiful, look at them. You can see me and you when you look at them. They're beautiful, like you. I love you. How could you do this to me? You know, I I just fell out of love with you. And I'm sorry it had to happen this way, but I didn't know what else to do. And he was there for me. I've been talking to him for a while, and I'm sorry I did it behind your back, but I didn't know what else to do. I was lonely. You weren't here. And plus, it seemed like at the time all you cared about was sex. You never wanted to do anything with me. You never wanted to show me your emotion. You never wanted to cuddle or do the things that I like to do. You just wanted to fuck all the time. And it made me sick. So yes, I moved on. I'm sorry I did it this way, but I had to. You'll get over it. You'll be happy one day. It's okay. Don't worry. After everything I did, I took care of you, me, and the kids by myself. Two years. And this is how you repay me? You gotta talk to some motherfucker you don't even know? Huh? For a year? Behind my back while I was busting my ass, paying these bills, paying the rent? Huh? Who put food on the table for you and the kids? Who paid for the gas in your car? Huh? Who made sure the rent was paid? Me. I'm sorry that I didn't show you the emotion you needed. I'm sorry I wasn't here for you. But I loved you. I still love you. I would do anything for you. I would do anything to put my family back together and be with my kids every day. But I can never trust you. I will never trust you. So unfortunately, you killed it.